What is up guys, today I bring you a new player review video and it's gonna be of Upgraded Aguero. So we're gonna be doing him because he has been requested by so many of you in the previous video. And that's how it works, you request him enough, uh, enough people request one player and that's, his, that's the person he's gonna be reviewed in the next video. So let me know in the comment section below who you want reviewed in the next video. So let's begin with 88 overall Aguero. He has Actually, let's begin with his advantages, guys, so we could see what separates his advantages and disadvantages. So, advantage-wise, he has very good free kicks. His stats don't say so, but I have tried him and he has really decent free kicks. So, if you want to take free kicks, don't get me wrong, shot power-wise, no. He's no good, no good at dipping free kicks, but he's good at... Uh, free kicks that you're gonna curve the ball with because his curve is pretty immense He's one of the best players I've tried and he has one of the best curves in the game guys I don't know about his stats, but his curve is one of the best curves I have played and used in the game his finesse shots Obviously are gonna be so good. So and his finishing is immense his finishing is crazy and Another thing is his strength for a small guy, this guy has strength. He's like, what is he, a fucking bodybuilder for his size? He is really strong for his size, guys. So let's begin with his disadvantages. It says 89 pace on the card. No fucking way he's 89 pace. He seems around 81 to 82. No way he's 89 pace, guys. That is a pretty down, big downfall for Aguero. I thought he would be much faster. He did not feel fast at all. Another thing is he has only 4-star skills. I would have thought he would have 5, but oh well. And he has his long shots are pretty shitty. I hated his long shots. They were disgusting. They were crap. Basically... When you want to take a long shot with Aguero, he would sprint with the ball and even if you find an open space, it will take him the next 45 minutes to fucking shoot the ball. He takes too long to shoot the ball and the way he shoots it is one of the most stupidest ways I've seen. So if you're if you're sprinting to, with the ball and you are about to shoot it, Aguero is sprinting and he's going to take the long shot. What he actually does is an animation of he sprints he he get, he get um he does one step back and then he shoots the ball Which seems i don't know seems so messed up to me and out of 20 long shots let's say i scored around 3 so he's not ideal for long shots guys he is pretty shit and um long shot power or shot power again he is not good at shot power either i think 87 shot goes mostly to curve that's why I find it so good, but shot power wise and long shots, he is not good at that. You might get a, you might get lucky with a couple of shots with Aguero, but he's not ideal, like I said. Another thing is his size. He is he is not tall, he is short. So if you want someone to head the ball, he has good heading accuracy, but that's if he could even get the ball in the air. Because there's so many tall de defenders guys, and he does get don't get me wrong, he can head the ball, but it's a 50-50 chance that he will get it in the air. So, that is pretty much it for Aguero. He is an 88 overall player, and he cost around 200k, so his price value is an advantage, because he's not that expensive for an 88 overall striker. He plays in the Premier League, which is one of the most overpriced leagues in the game, but that's how it is so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comment section below who you want me to review next and one more thing that i want to say is aguero looks like a monkey in fifa 12 so hopefully you guys enjoyed it and i hope you have a very nice day